Hi there, welcome again to check out the last volume of the Cinema 4D Everything series. A little bit about myself. My name is Pavel Zoch and I'm an official Cinema 4D local evangelist and generalist and I did an official support of Cinema 4D for Czech and Slovak Republics for more than 11 years. I've written 100 articles on Cinema 4D, 100 hours of video tutorials and I've made a Czech version for Cinema 4D as well. You can know my work from the official Maxim webpage, brochures and other Maxim public relation stuff as well. The first volume of the series covers an elementary using of Cinema 4D with 14. I understand the Cinema 4D level system, workflow and philosophy. The first volume will explain all main managers, palettes, commands, tools and their shortcuts. I you that's not all, because the main topic of the volume is the modeling and its elementaries. It explains how polygons, edges and points work, the important difference between quadrangles and triangles, how important polygons normals are, and so on. All tools are demonstrated to basic modeling and modeling via generators. The second volume of the series goes deeper, of course but the work is still based on very procedural approach. It will cover an advanced using of Cinema 4D deformers, clone generators, etc. They are able to generate extremely very complex articles like attire. I will show you how to prepare the main parts Amos visual manual modeling. In this last volume we will talk about point to point, or we can say polygon to polygon modeling method and box modeling. Both these methods are very flexible. Which one to use is up to you. This last volume shows both of them and they are used to create the front fork, handlebar, grids objects, the seat and so on. This volume shows you many very sophisticated tricks and features. The morph tech is one of them. Here are a few other though. The mesh deformer uses the cloner of the spline and use of the explosion is deformer for a thickness creation and others. The volume closes the modeling process of the bike, but the work continues. I will explain all about the UV mesh editing. The UV mesh and parametric textures projections are also the topic of this third volume. Cinema 4D has two main phases, Cinema 4D and Body Paint 3D. It's the same application, but two different worlds. The first for modeling, animation, rendering and so on. The second belongs to UV mesh editing and painting. You will learn everything about the UV editing. After that you will understand the workflow, body paint CD layout, texture view, UV mix structure, tools, relaxing modes and so on. The last chapters of the volume are dedicated to rendering and texturing with a prepared library file. Don't wait any longer and complete this amazing series. Thank you for watching and see you at www.c4d.cz.